Let's program and be creative. It's time for MIT App Inventor. In this video, we're going over the AP Computer Science Principles app that we're going to build for Big Idea 3.8 iteration, Big Idea 3.9, developing algorithms, and Big Idea 3.10 list. The app we're going to be building is the COVID-19 prevention app and it's going to have all of these things in it but let's actually look at those big ideas 3.8, 3.9, and 3.10. These are the topics that are covered on the AP Computer Science Principles big idea. 3.8 iteration learning objective express an algorithm that uses iteration without using a programming language. Iteration is repeating a portion of the algorithm. Iteration repeats a specific number of times or until a given condition is met. These are the things you're going to need on the AP Computer Science Principles exam, and these are the things we're going to actually build in our COVID-19 app. Here is another learning objective. For iteration, write iteration statements. Determine the result of side effects of iteration statements. You also want to make sure that you review this essential knowledge on the right side. That is what you will see on the AP Computer Science Principles exam. So this is Big Idea 3.8 Iteration. We will cover this in this app. 3.9, Developing Algorithms. You can see your learning objectives are to compare algorithms to determine if they yield the same side effects or results. And again, you want to make sure that you re review all this essential knowledge on the right side. Here's your next learning objective. For algorithms, create algorithms. We will do that in this COVID-19 awareness app. Combine and modify existing algorithms. We will do that in this COVID-19 awareness app. So that is 3.9 developing algorithms. 3.10 list. We've used list throughout this school year, but we also are gonna use it in this COVID-19 awareness app. For list, here's your learning objectives. For list operations, write expressions that use list indexing and list procedures. And again, you wanna make sure that you review the essential knowledge. Over here, evaluate expressions that use list indexing and list procedures. We will do that in this COVID-19 awareness app. For algorithms involving elements of a list, write iteration statements to traverse a list. We will do that in this. Determine the result of algorithms that include list traversals. Again, we will do that in this app. And you can see, make sure that you review this. These are the type of questions you will see on AP Classroom and you will see at the end of the year on the AP Computer Science Principles exam. So these are the things we're gonna cover in this app. For day one, you're going to simply design the app. So these are the things you're gonna cover 3.8, 3.9, 3.10 and 3.10 in this COVID-19 awareness app. For day one, we're simply going to do the design of this. Now you're going to need a couple things. I'm going to give you all these files that you're going to need. So you're gonna to need to download these files and download these sounds. So I give you some sounds that we're going to do. Make sure you download those. And then on the page, you can see I am giving you my exact design of the app, what it should look like. We've built apps throughout this entire year, so you should know how to use design in MIT App Inverter really well by now. You can design anything you want using different media and different components. So now for this assignment, you're just going to simply look at my assignment and you can zoom in and you can see the components that I have and I want you to design your app by following my example. And you can see this is screen one, you're gonna have a prevention memory game screen. This is going to be the game part of it. You're gonna, it's gonna be like Simon, and I'll show you it in a second. This is the CDC screen. This is how it will look. And this is the about COVID screen. This screen, you're gonna have your much freedom as you want on it. Use your creativity, use your design to put some information about COVID-19. Again, you can read underneath each one about COVID-19. I give you a description of how to design it. Again, here, CDC screen, I give you a description of how to design it. Prevention memory screen, I give you a description on how to design it. And again, screen one, I give you the description. So let's actually look at the app, what you're going to be building. Even though you're not gonna code anything today, let's see what your end result is. Over here in MIT App Inventor, you can see I have my app, but let's look at the emulator. So I have created by, I have my prevention memory game, and I have my about screen. If you look at here, I can just show you each one of the screens. Here's my game screen. 
ready for the game and touch the prevention steps function in the correct order to get the high score. You can see I have my about COVID screen. And again, this screen, you're going to have the most freedom on. You can design whatever you want. And you also need to have a CDC website screen where you're going to have a web viewer with two buttons on top. And you can see when you have a web viewer, if you look at my web viewer, I have the CDC website in here. And again, you can get that by following the directions right here. I give you the website to place in. You're simply going to place that inside of there, inside of your web viewer. And you can see over here it looks blank, but on your emulator or on your phone, you can actually scroll the website and click on stuff. And this is the actual CDC website about COVID-19. So that is that page. The heart of our app is going to be this memory game. Help prevent COVID-19 spread. Play the game and touch the prevention steps spoken in the correct order to get the high score. So to kind of help awareness, we're going to play a memory game where it has these five things and you have to click them in the order that they say. And if you get it wrong, then you have to start over. So you can see right now the high score is eight. My score is zero. I'm gonna go ahead and press play. Hand sanitizer. So I said hand sanitizer. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer. So I said it twice. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect. So hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect social distance. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect social distance. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect social distance, disinfect. Hand sanitizer, hand sanitizer, disinfect social distance, hand sanitizer. Oh, just do what it says. Four, Try again. So you can see I lost. My score was five. I needed a high score of an eight. Let's see if we can try to get a high score. But you kind of get the point. This is trying to promote how to prevent COVID-19 spread by doing this simple memory game. Social distance. Social distance. Social distance. Social distance. Social distance. Wash hands. Social distance. Social distance. Wash hands. Social distance. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands. This is to get the high scores. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands, wash hands. I got a score of nine, so I already have the high score. So let's see if I can get to number 10. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands, wash hands. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands, wash hands, social distance. Okay, social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands, wash hands, social distance. Social distance, social distance, wash hands, social distance, disinfect, wash hands, social distance, wash hands, wash hands, social distance, wear masks. So you can see, I, I'm going to stop here. I got the high score. I'm going to get something wrong. You set, the, again. you set the new high four of 11, play again. So this is the 
type of COVID-19 prevention, we have a simple memory game that we're going to build. But for again, today only, all you're doing is designing out your app. You're gonna use the skills that you've learned throughout the school year to design your screen one, your prevention memory game screen, which is here, you're gonna use the files that I've given you, your CDC screen, you're gonna follow this design here, and then your about COVID screen, which you will use your creativity to design this however you want to provide the information you want to your user.